Hi, my name is Rima Danielle Joma. I am 29 years old today. Today is my birthday. And I have to say that this is one of the most exciting times in my life for many different reasons, which I'll talk about. I'm a marriage and family therapist. And in my internship, I discovered yoga as a way to help me to meditate. It wasn't for physical benefits. It was purely because I was learning more about spirituality and I wanted to learn how to calm my mind. I was a very, I don't want to say anxious, but always on the go, always going. Didn't know how to calm down, didn't know how to relax. And so I started practicing yoga as a way to become more connected to spirit and more present in each moment. And through learning about yoga and practicing yoga in my daily life, both on and off the mat, my life has changed in so many ways. One of those ways is I found face yoga, and specifically face yoga method. And although I haven't been practicing it for very long, it has brought tremendous amounts of change, positive change in my life. I'm from California, from Los Angeles originally, and I live in San Clemente, which is a little beach town just north of San Diego. And I also live and work part-time in Costa Rica, back and forth, doing many different entrepreneurial things. And one of the things that I am now wanting to teach people is face yoga, because it has changed my life so dramatically. It is January 28th, as of this recording, 2016. And I purchased face my, the membership to the face yoga method at the end of November and started really practicing the routine December 1st. And within days, I already noticed many mental and physical improvements and benefits. For me specifically, what I can say is that it's changed the way I see myself. Um, I've always, always, always had a problem with picking at my face. It's just something that since I was a little girl, it's driven my parents crazy, everyone that knows me, and it's always been my downfall. <laughs> and kind of out of anxiety, and out of just, a ha you know, a nervous habit picking up my face. And so I've had a lot of scarring that's happened as a result of that. And not only scarring, but just open wounds on my face all the time, which I think I learned psychologically to not let bother me, but it definitely bothered those around me, um, not because of vanity, but just because they didn't want to see me hurting myself. And the biggest thing that face yoga method has done for me is it's completely eliminated my habit of picking. Nothing else has done that before. As a therapist, I tried many different kinds of therapy um, to help me with that, and it was just something that I was not able to get over and I sort of just accepted it as something that I would always do and face yoga method has helped me to replace those habits with positive ones now when I go to look in the mirror instead of finding things to pick up my face I start doing face yoga I found the face yoga method through an online search on YouTube because intuitively as a yoga teacher I realized that we were completely neglecting our faces in yoga, they tell you, relax your face, rest your face, you know, but what does that mean? And I at first realized that I was scrunching my face up, right? You kind of like hold and you tense and you're in this pose. And then when you relax your face, you can feel, oh my gosh, so calm and so relaxed. And you start to notice throughout the day that you are holding your face in these various ways and contorted ways when you're upset or angry or anxious or whatever it might be. And so I knew that there was a missing link there, and, and I just thought, okay, someone has to have talked about this before. So I started Googling face yoga, and I found Fumiko and her methods, and so I let, went for it, I did it, and I also purchased the derma rollers. The combination of those things, in addition to creating a morning routine, has dramatically changed my face and my perception about myself. Um, I wake up every morning now, I scrape my tongue, I floss my teeth, I brush my teeth, um, I drink lots of water, hot water, which is something I'm still needing to do more of. So that's my resolution for 2016 is to continue drinking water. 
I also do my face yoga. I, I derma roll, I moisturize, and I do my face yoga exercises in the morning as well as throughout the day. So just physically, I've already noticed that the area under my eyes has improved dramatically. This was my problem area. I didn't know about moisturizing properly. I didn't know about all the different things that I should be doing. I wasn't washing my face properly. And so the combination of all the things I started doing, I think, is what's really, really helped. Um, I noticed that I was aging very quickly towards the end of my 20s. Um, I do spend a lot of time in the sun, and so those things were starting to have an effect, um, in addition to the bumpiness in my skin from picking and from scarring. It has gone down dramatically. So, I mean, you don't haven't seen me before, but this is actually the best that my skin has ever looked, you know, just two months into doing face yoga. And I know that it's just going to continue to improve. And it's, it's so exciting. It makes me emotional because I never really imagined that I would be the kind of person that, you know, people could compliment my skin. And I can see that it's going in that direction. And um, it's very, very exciting. Um, so those, you know, those things, the routine in the morning, and then just learning the face yoga and doing it throughout the day, not in any specific routine or not in any specific fashion that is, what should I say, um, what's the word I'm looking for, like militant, you know, I'm not like, waking up and spending two hours a day doing it. It might be five minutes here. It might be when I'm in the car. You know, it might be when I'm working at the computer, putting a pen behind the teeth. Just those very little things have just helped me to gain an awareness of how I carry my face throughout the day and have just to help me stop picking up my face, really. First and foremost, that's the biggest gift that face yoga has brought for me. So I would definitely recommend that if you are someone who... Maybe you don't pick out your face, but maybe you have noticed that you're aging a little more quickly than you would want to. Give face yoga a try. Yes, the videos are available for free, but until you make that commitment and you invest in yourself, it's really hard to stick with it throughout the day, to create a routine. And that's really what you're doing. You're investing in yourself. What the little amount of money that you pay to join this membership, you get it for life. And the knowledge that you have, you will retain for life. I am so blessed that I found this in my 20s because I can only imagine if I waited till I was in my 30s or 40s and the effects of the sun and aging were worse, that I might still, you know, I might not be inclined to do it. I might think, oh, it's too late. What difference is it going to make? But I can guarantee you, whatever age that you are, wherever you are in your life, that these exercises and this knowledge, this investment will benefit you. I have no affiliation with Fumiko in a sales standpoint. I don't work for her. This is just truly something that I believe to have changed my life so fast, <laughs> way quicker than anything I've ever tried. I've spent thousands of dollars on facials and microdermabrasion products, all to no avail. Nothing helped. And it you know, not only did it not help my skin, it didn't help my behavior of picking up my skin. It wasn't until I really replaced it with something that I see to be extremely positive that I have noticed a difference. As a teacher of yoga, it's something that I will definitely start bringing into my classes and to my students as I learn more about it. And that's something that I'm very excited for too, because like I said, I feel that we neglect the face muscles and we're not really aware of them. I think that we don't realize how much damage we do throughout the day just by holding our face in certain positions. I'm much more aware of my forehead now. I tense my forehead here and here and you know I still do it but I'm more aware of it now. I'm more aware of the symmetry in my eyes. Um, my right eye is the one that I focus on strengthening to bring more symmetry to that area and just overall I have more confidence. So if you are wondering if the face yoga method is worth the investment, I can tell you yes, it is definitely worth the investment. I used to have the nylon uh, Sonicare brush that they sell, and I ended up selling that many years ago because it just didn't work for me. It didn't do anything, and I found that it was more damaging for my, for my skin than it was helpful. And this brush 
that I purchased from Finuco has been amazing. Um, I love the silicone uh, bristles on it. I think it's much safer, much cleaner, and much gentler on the skin, and I would definitely recommend and the Derma Roller. Um, the last thing I would say that I've done that I've changed is I purchased the Save My Face pillow that Finuco um, endorses on her products we love page. I got it on Amazon because I do sleep on my side and it's been something that I've been trying to change for a long time um, but it's been a little challenging and so the, the pillow has really helped me to not wake up with face puffiness now that I've been doing face yoga method I've become more aware in the mornings that my face looks um, tired, one side is puffier and I can tell it's the creases in my um, nasolabial fold is more pronounced on this side because I usually sleep on this side. So it's just helped me to overall, I cannot say it enough, have awareness. Even if you don't change anything about what you're doing, being aware of what you're doing makes a difference. All these little things build upon one another so that instead of damaging your face throughout the day, you're doing different things to protect your face. And I'm, again, so grateful, so thankful that I found these things when I did. I'm entering my 29th year of life feeling healthier, younger looking than I did when I was 25, which is insane, <laughs> but true. And I know that that will just continue to take off. You know, only two months into the program, I'm already experiencing these amazing benefits. I can only imagine five years from now when all my peers unfortunately continue to age and don't take care of themselves, uh, the difference that I will see within myself and that others will see. So if you have any questions or you'd like to talk to me about my experiences, please feel free to reach out. Um, you can find me online, just Google my name and I would be more than happy to give you uh, some of my feedback, some of my tips and different things that have worked for me as time goes on. Um, Thank you, Fumiko. Thank you, Maria. Thank you, Face Yoga Method. I am eternally grateful.